Welcome back to another animation recommendation. And today I want to talk about Frank Abney's short film, Canvas. If you check your notifications, you will see in the email that Canvas has been released on Netflix. And the synopsis of Canvas is, after a heartbreaking loss, a grandfather struggling to reclaim his passion for painting finds inspiration to create again. As you can see, it's rated G and it's in glorious widescreen format. But I'm not going to play the whole thing. You should obviously watch it. But I do want to show you little things. I'm not going to go too far because of spoilers. But when you look at it, you can see that it starts in a 2D form. And as we switch to CG, you can see there's a lot of detail in the animation, a lot of detail in the textures. It has a lot of really, really nicely composed shots. And again, you can go forward again. I don't want to go too far. It takes place outside. It takes place inside the house. As you go from nighttime, as it switches to daytime, shots like that, come on, they're absolutely beautiful. I'll leave it at that. I don't want to go too far, but it's a really touching story. And anybody who has a wife, husband, partner, as they watch shorts and movies like that, I can't just watch it. I project and think about my wife in case I would lose her. It's very, there are some gut punches in there. And it does really well showcasing that through pantomime only. Because the tricky thing with short movies is that is the budget. You got to find a budget, obviously, to animate it, the whole production, the music, but also voices. And if voice artists are not part of your production, it has to be all told through silence and pantomime. And I think the short does it really, really well. Every now and then, it feels like a quiet place where you you want them to say something and but they're not saying anything but it it does work really well i think the animation is very expressive they're very appealing designs but everything is told through the story and the facial reactions of the older person and the granddaughter and to some degree a bit of the mother but it's mostly those two that combined with the music which is also really good i think just tells the story in a really really beautiful way it clocks in at around nine minutes including credits Speaking of credits, that's the only negative, and it's not a negative for Frank, but the short is really, really good. I highly recommend you watch it, it's really touching. But anybody watching this who's at Netflix, please, please, please stop with the grabbing the movie into the corner while the credits are rolling and showing you, oh, you might be interested in something else. I think this movie, especially any movie that is more emotional and touching as you soak in the end, as the music kicks in and you just wanna think about what you just watched, it just takes you out, puts the movie in a corner, and it tells you, hey, something else like that. And it's just, it's just really disruptive. So anybody at Netflix with power, there should be at least some option. There were some things that I turned off, like the automatic trailer view something when you're on a movie, so because of spoilers, but I haven't found uh, a way to turn that off. So if anybody of you know, let me know in the comments if there's anything that I missed in the settings, but such a bummer. That was the biggest thing. Ah, just let that short breathe. Let me go through the credits, soak in the music and who works worked on this, that's the, the biggest bummer, which has nothing to do with Frank. That is 100% Netflix. Don't do this Netflix, please. But that's it. If you have Netflix, go watch it. If you don't have Netflix, sign up and watch it. And the good news is that Frank is going to direct his own movie. So I am very pumped to see what he does with that. Other than that, that's it. Thanks to Frank and the whole team for making this short. It was really, really good. Any of you watching this, head over to Netflix and watch the short. Link in the description, of course, with the link to that. And that's it. Thanks for watching and see you in my next upload.